the African bush elephant, the largest animal to walk on the land currently. The African bush elephant is a part of a family group of mammals called the Afrothiers, a group of mammals which were thought to have originated from Africa. Specifically, African bush elephants belong to the proboscidean group of Afrothiers and are specifically in the group Elephantiform. The Loxodonta genus, according to science, has been around for millions of years, and African bush elephants aren't alone in this genus. There are also the African forest elephant and the African desert elephant, along with some extinct species, such as Loxodonta adorora and Loxodonta cookie. So get ready to learn about these magnificent giants of the savanna, the African bush elephant. Being the largest animal on the land, the African bush elephant male can stand up to 13.1 feet tall and can weigh up to 13 tons. Females, on the other hand, can get up to 10 to 11 feet tall and can weigh 7 to 11 tons. Bush elephants are not only notorious for their size, but also for some of their appendages as well. They support 11 foot long tusks that they use to fight and knock down trees, big ears to regulate body temperature in the savanna, a long and flexible trunk used for sniffing, drinking, and grabbing items, and the longest eyelashes in the world for keeping out dust and debris. African bush elephants are strict herbivores and will only eat plants. They will eat any plant that they can find and will often travel long distances just to find this food so they can keep going. The African bush elephant's memory is impeccable and they never forget anything as the so-called myths say. An African bush elephant's memory is very much crucial to its survival as they live in drier climates and need this memory to remember places like water holes, food locations, and very lush areas, so then their herd, or they, won't die. African bush elephant males live solitary lifestyles and will only come together with females to mate. African bush elephant males, though, are very social and will sometimes live in bachelor herds. Living a solitary lifestyle, though, can cause a couple of problems, especially for a male African bush elephant, as they are prized by poachers and are often hunted down for their very much large tusk. But their size, on the other hand, helps them deter predators. African bush elephant females, on the other hand, live very social lifestyles with their calves, aunts, and sisters. The matriarch of this herd leads it and is the oldest and most experienced female. She leads them to watering holes, feeding locations, and many other places that are beneficial to the herd's survival. But living in a herd with calves can be a very big problem as predators are attracted. African bush elephants are very intelligent animals and their intelligence rivals that of dolphins and orcas and even chimpanzees. African bush elephants have been known to hold grudges, make friends, have close bonds, and even help other animals out, and even use tools. African bush elephants even sometimes teach other elephants how to do certain things. African bush elephants have great and very keen senses, such as the greatest sense of smell and very great hearing in which they can hear low frequency calls that no other animal can hear but other elephants. African bush elephants don't just live in the savanna, but are also found in wetlands and forests, as they are very crucial to these habitats, and if they were removed, 
the entire habitat would fall. African bush elephants can be found throughout many countries in Africa, such as Botswana, Kenya, and Uganda. But their numbers have been slowly declining throughout the years. African bush elephants can live up to the age of 70, but today, not a lot of African bush elephants can live to those ages because of poachers hunting their tusks. But it's not all bad, as us humans have been helping out African bush elephants since they were starting to go extinct. Now, they number 415,000 strong and are roaming the savannas of Africa. But there are some things you can do to help stop the illegal hunting of ivory. For starters, you have the choice to not support any ivory products, as this will hurt elephant populations if you do support them. And secondly, you can join organizations that help out elephants and all sorts of other wildlife to prevent extinction overall. And lastly, you can spread the word about our friends, the elephants. And if we follow these steps, we can prevent the African bush elephant from extinction and still see them roam the savannas. Okay, so, um, yeah, thank you for watching my video, uh, I don't really know what to say about this, I mean, I put my heart and my soul into this video, and, um, I mean, please let me know if I were great on the elephant facts, because I know a lot more about elephants, but I didn't really want this to be a super long form video. But I still feel like I could have added more facts about elephants because I mean I know more. So please let me know if I was good on the elephant facts or if you wanted to know more. But uh, anyways, thank you for watching this video. I know I'm very limited on my subscribers, but uh, thank you though. And um, uh, the next episode for Lux and Anta series, I don't know when that's going to come out. That's if I have the time, which may be a long time. But... Uh, I'll see what I can do. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later. And don't you think I forgot about the credits? Oh, no. I'm about to put in the credits right now. <laughs> okay, so the following channels I want to thank for letting me use your footage is Scenic Relaxation, 4K Relaxation Channel, um, Animals and Pets, and It's All About Time Music. I also want to thank Siso Purple on Debian Art for letting me use his art of Loxodonta at Aurora, and also Wikipedia for letting me use their picture of Africa. And the last channel I want to thank is uh, Play and Fade for the sound effects in the beginning where the African bush elephants are marching. And I promise you, this is the last part, so yeah, uh, I'll see you later. There's a lion right here, he's looking at you. <laughs> and now we're back to elephants, guys. Okay, I promise you, I was only gonna stop by the elephants, alright? See you later. Okay, I'm sorry, I thought that would be less thing. No, there was one more channel. Um, it's Gloria Templum for letting me use their music, their traffic music in the beginning, and I'll see you later, seriously.